Prince Charles snubs Meghan Markle in heartfelt Archie birthday message, Duchess left out. Meghan Markle was snubbed by Prince Charles after he posted an image celebrating Archie's second birthday. Today, the son of Meghan and Prince Harry celebrated his second birthday. Members of the royal family, including Prince William and Kate, the Duchess of Cambridge, took to social media to wish Archie a happy birthday. The Duke and Duchess of Cornwall posted on Twitter, Happy birthday to Archie, who turns two today. The message also included the emoji of a birthday cake and a black and white picture taken during the reception after Archie's christening in July 2019. In the snap by photographer Chris Allerton, the Prince of Wales smiles at his grandson who looks back at him while in the arms of his dad Harry. But Meghan is noticeably absent from the snap. Charles has not seen his grandson since Meghan and Harry stepped down from the royal family and moved to California last year. Prince Charles hasn't been the only senior royal to publicly wish Archie a happy birthday today. The royal family Twitter account, which represents the Queen and all the working royals without their own social media pages, wrote earlier today, wishing Archie Mountbatten Windsor a very happy second birthday today. Similarly, Gate and Prince William's Twitter account Kensington Royal wrote, wishing Archie a very happy second birthday today. According to royal expert Katie Nicholl, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will check in with some members of the firm, including the Queen. She told OK, we know that Harry still speaks regularly with his grandmother and one of the Queen's joys is to see Archie. I'm sure there will be a Zoom call with her on his special day. Ems Nicol also suggested Prince Harry will put aside any brotherly squabbles so that Archie can enjoy a call to his cousins, Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. She said, Harry. Always wanted his children to grow up close to William and Kate's. That would be the childhood he enjoyed with his own cousins, Zara, Beatrice, and Eugenie. Sadly it's looking increasingly unlikely for Archie. Very little is known about how much the brothers have spoken in recent months and what the situation is between them, but I find it hard to imagine that the Cambridges won't at least pick up the phone on Archie's birthday. Harry's relationship with his family has grown strained following his explosive interview with Oprah Winfrey back in March. The Duke of Sussex told the media mogul he feels let down by his father, who he accused of a lack of support despite having gone through similar experiences. He added, of course, I will always love him, but there's a lot of hurt that's happened. And I will continue to make it one of my priorities to try and heal that relationship. Prince Harry also claimed Prince Charles stopped taking his calls after he had spoken to him twice about his and Meghan's plans to quit as full-time working royals. Last month, Harry reunited with his family during the funeral of Prince Philip. After the funeral, the Duke of Sussex was seen walking back to Windsor Castle with his brother Prince William. While at the castle, the brothers spoke together with Prince Charles. The Prince of Wales, however, is not going to be
castle with his brother Prince William. While at the castle, the brothers spoke together with Prince Charles. The Prince of Wales, however, is not believed to have spoken alone with his youngest son before he traveled back to California.